Hello students, and welcome to the next lesson in our AS Level Psychology course. Today we're going to be looking at stress and heart disease. What is heart disease? Research shows that high stress levels can increase the risk of heart disease. We're going to be looking at these studies later on in the course. Heart disease occurs when the cardiovascular system stops functioning. It's no longer able to pump blood to and from the heart through the body. So as a result, you're not going to be able to oxygenate the cells that you need in able to live. So as a result, you can end up dying. How stress increases the risk of heart disease. In the HPA system, otherwise known as the adrenal pituitary system, fatty acids are released by corticosteroids. These are meant to give the individual more energy to deal with stress. However, they can have the potential to block the bloodstream and as a result this blocks the flow of blood, preventing it to getting from the heart and thus increasing risk of heart disease. Also, in the SAM system, or the sympathomedullary system, adrenaline is released by the adrenal medulla. This increases blood pressure by narrowing the blood vessel to get someone ready to combat the stress. However, because the blood vessels are narrower, the heart has to work harder to pump the blood around. If it can't work that hard, insufficient oxygenated blood will get into the heart and it can fail, as a result potentially dying and having heart disease. Here are some questions on heart disease and stress. Answer these on another sheet of paper and then pause the video to give yourself time. Hit play whenever you're ready to see the answers. Here are the answers. If you got both of these right, congratulations. I'd advise you to move on to the next video, which will be on stress and the immune system. Visit www.reviseairlevel.co.uk or any of the other playlists on the channel to revise for your other subjects. As always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again next time. Goodbye.